Sealy Lake Park. It's weird they've kind of cut off the regular parking spot for this place. I mean, we're right across from the police station, so I don't think there's going to be a problem, but still. I was coming here because it's a quirky park. It's... It... It has sections where you're just right on the back side of some apartments and some other buildings, and it's just... It's just kind of weird. I wouldn't call this a great park by any means, but it's quirky. And there are some good sections of it. And I hadn't been here. I hadn't been here um, right at the end of summer, where, where you're just starting to get some of the falling leaves, but it's not full-fledged, full you know, leaves everywhere. on the ground. And yeah, that is uh, Lakewood Street. Is it Drive or is it Avenue? I don't know which. Which eventually becomes Orchard after you pass a certain uh, couple streets. Isn't that weird how... In so many places there are roads that change names once it crosses other roads. I don't know. When that happens too much, I'm just like, yeah, that's, why, 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 why did you do that? I don't know, I'm, I, uh, I'm in favor of the nice, easy to understand grids that remain consistent. They don't look as nice though, so. I'm surprised I'm not getting eaten up by mosquitoes. As I say this now, maybe by the time I'm done with this, I will be, but... Because off to the right... ...is that, uh, lake, which is more... It's more of you, I don't even know whether you can really call it a real lake, but it's... ...just, it's more of a swamp. Here, let's look at this a little more here, if we can see in there. No, not really. Not a very good look in there, anyway. Kind of interesting to see this when, uh, like I said, you know, when we, end of summer and you get the different vegetation that's come up and... Oh, well, isn't that a lush little section, isn't it?
I think there's some areas deep in here where people uh, are camped out. But they don't bother anyone. So. I can't keep that up. You know, I'm used to people walking their dogs and such through here. I haven't seen anyone here yet. I hope that's not a bad sign. Oh, they really cleaned up this trail right here. This was crashed. I'm going to be eventually coming back this way, but I want to look at how they cleaned this up. This is almost not recognizable. Wow. Of course, I think the last time I saw this, it was covered in leaves, so... Huh. Alright, it just, it just ends right there, and then that's it. But I just wanted to see what it looked like. Very little garbage, I mean, compared to what it was. Ah, oh, there's someone. I'll go kind of slow so he doesn't think I'm trying to, like, follow him. I mean, he saw me when I was on the other part of the trail, but... If I go slow enough, he'll be out of the view.
a little bit of wind there. All right, he's out of view now. And I mean, this, 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 what's interesting too, all, all across, I, I should have, uh, you know, I want to look at that. I didn't realize it went all the way across the, uh, the graffiti. Wow. All the way. Wow. Yeah, I never, uh, I didn't notice this the last time I was here. Wow. I'm not gonna feature the whole thing, but I'm gonna at least feature some of it anyway. much more that way so okay time to walk back down <laughs> don't even know if that was very good coverage of it but maybe some other time I'll, I'll do the whole thing kind of neat. I love exploring graffitied areas. See another another just this is a beautiful section of this park. So it has its it has its bleh. it has its pluses, but I don't know it's quirky. bit quieter now that we're not by the traffic. Now if I'd just shut up, right?
And that almost sounded like a growling dog. Let's see if I can do this right. I did, okay, good. Yeah, if you look up here, you can see that here are some apartments that are just right next to the, uh, to the trails, but it gets, that's not the weird part. The weird part, I mean, yeah, it's places right next to the trails, but just how close it is, is, is a trip. Shopping anyone? From Marshalls, huh? They went a ways for that. It'd be pretty neat to live this close to these trails. Just right on your doorstep, here's some nature. It's pretty cool. See what I mean? It's right up against it here. This isn't the weird one though. Some of these buildings that will be coming up are, are the weird part. I guess maybe it's not that weird. Maybe I'm overhyping it or something. I just know this is kind of a quirky little park. You know, want a nice 20 minute, 25 minute um, walk somewhere around there. It's golden as far as that goes, you know. You know, I'm not sure if these are the same color they used to be. I don't know what I think of this color combo. Well, it probably won't look dated. The benefits of choosing an unusual color palette. Well, never look dated.
I don't remember this. Oh, just, oh, and just another way to get here. All right. God, up on the rooftop, click, click, click. Why the hell is that shit going through my head? Yeah, I think they repainted this one too. Here comes the, uh, the weird overhang piece. Surprised there's not more graffiti there. Maybe there was and it's been recovered a bunch of times, but. The architecture. Hey, how's it going? And let's hope that my car isn't being towed. It's been the one thing in the back of my mind. I'm saying, you know, people say you can park there. Yes, I'm fine. It is fine. This is fine. The uh, burning building meme, right? <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs>